Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Always do your best. Express your own divinity. You don't need the acceptance of others. You don't need knowledge or great philosophical concepts. You have the right to be you and express your own divinity by being alive, loving yourself, and loving others. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 236, NASDAQ up 26, SP's up 15 and a half, gold contract up $5.90 trading at 1936 an ounce. We have silver down three cents, twenty-three dollars thirty-one cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck eighty-seven, seventy-four dollars eighty-seven cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. A ten-year note up two ticks, trading one eleven oh seven. The thirty-year up six at one twenty-four oh eight. And king dollar. King dollar's down two hundred and thirty-seven ticks, trading one oh one seven thirty-five. The euro is at one oh nine. The yen is at one forty, and the British pound is at one twenty-nine to one U.S. dollar. Our phone number is eight seven seven. Nine two seven six six four eight. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world and the world of the S and P's? Let's take a look at them. So let's look at the future first. Okay. So you get a market that wants higher price. As you're climbing here, you know you're losing the juice behind it, meaning the volume behind it. What we just did here, and we we made this high this morning, um, you know, at uh, twelve twelve ten. Uh, bottom line, you know, you can see that what ended up happening, we ended up taking out the high from 1140. Now, that had 70,000 shares traded, right? Uh, contracts traded, right? But now watch this, because this is, like, hit, hit pretty intense. You went, you did 33,000, and then we did 10, we did 30,000. Well, your benchmark is that 70, and then, ba boom, you went from the high of 4465 and a heartbeat down to 45, 44.52. That's what happens, folks, when you get over and there's that type of discrep dis discrepancy on a percentage basis. Okay, so now, bottom line, what are we doing? Well, the bottom line is that it, it last borrowed here, we did 26,000, and, you know, we're dealing with 30, so you're not dealing with much. I suspect that, you know, we don't have... Yeah, we don't, we don't have a high volume low. See, because that high volume low from this morning, see the high volume low from this morning, 54,000? Well, just use your crosshairs. That was actually going into 92,000. That's how that works. If you're looking, you know, using time in the trade. That's you know, that's bottom line is that, hey, who's ever buying over there, guess what? They decided they're going to be at it again. We go into the NQs. So the NQs definitely led down the first you know, pullback this morning, at, well, at noon. And what the NQs do have, this is what the difference is. Remember this happened a couple of weeks ago, too. Well, by, yeah, a couple of weeks ago. The NQs do have some volume down here, you know. Not, not the highest volume, because the highest volume is that, and this is kind of cool to look at. See, the highest volume is at the, the 15,146. That there, we did... 32,000, and then we got down again to 15,152 with 7,000. With 7, you see how that works? 7,000 versus 32,000. Is that only 7,000? Yeah, 7,000. We're going higher, man. Oh, that ain't even close. You see, hey, we're going to go over this again, man. That 7,000 and you would you're talking thirty two thousand. This market wants higher price. That that even that Nasdaq. NASDAQ we're going to higher price, man. That that's pretty intense. Gold gold contract right now is building costs for a higher price. Um, you know, still to get a sideways move out here. The we have a seven hundred no hundred seventy one thousand contracts out here today. Not not bad contract volume. We made it up to 1944, you're at 1937 right now. You're going to need more volume, and you're going to crack this, this whole deal. Because the resistance is still going to come in on a monster basis at 1040, and that's what keeps happening. You see, that that's ice. That's, that's what that is. We put it this way. 
that's ice. You know, so we jumped the creek. It had volume when you jumped the creek. You know, it's going to try to get by that pot. You know, bottom line, I expect it's going to get by that pot. Why? Because if we get over to this dollar, this dollar wants to get down into par. And we'll see how this shakes out. Couldn't hold price today. You know, almost, almost, you know, made a nice hammer today, okay? That was early this morning. Couldn't handle it. So your next leg here is somewhere about 100.756. Now, let's bring this back a little bit because if we actually get action going, I want to show you something because this is, this is where if the dollar actually can't hold this level, then you are going to see gold go to the moon as well as the market <laughs> because this level here, you know, we, we get under the 100 point, let's say, 7 to 800, you're in a whole other range. The, the next level down there is 89, 200, you know, and that's, that's how markets move, man. That's the bottom line. Uh, we had a question about the uh, XLE on ABC up. It's not an ABC up. The reason it's not an ABC, this is what you have to get your head wrapped around here because of July 3rd, so... The XLE, you know, it, it's, it's going higher, so it wants, it wants higher price. But I'm just saying it's not an ABC up. The reason being, see how it's taking out that B point? That B point was July 3rd. So when you do the count volume calculation, you actually need 18.1 million shares, you know, A to B equals C to D. Now, that being said, you know, you, you're taking out the top of the consolidation, which is 82.51. You're at 83. So, you know, bottom line is that, yeah, you can get up to this 87 anyway, either way. Some of the higher volume equities that we have out here today, you have, uh, let's see what we got. No, let's go inside the NDX 100. So inside the NDX 100, you got Activision. Yeah, the Microsoft's going to take over Activision. That's up 10%. You got, um, what is that? That's the electronics arts up 5%. Airbnb's up 4%. Datadog's up 3.5%. Taken away from it, AMAT's down 3 AMD's off 2, Zscale is off 2.3, and you got Clack off 2.4. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Come right back with our man, Mr. Basil Chapman. We are going to be growling and prowling with Basil Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 225, Nasdaq's up 28, S&P's up 15. We'll come right back. <laughs> 